everyone, my name is Andrea Long. I'm the Chief Program Officer here at the Up Center. And I want to spend a few minutes today talking to you about a very important issue. May is Mental Health Awareness Month. And here at the Up Center, we know that mental health is important for children, for adults, just about everyone. Mental health is an issue that we all need to be concerned about because it's a universal experience. What I know is sometimes the word mental health kind of gets a bad rap. I think people associate mental health as being a bad thing. And what we know is that mental health is about how we're feeling, how we're interacting, how we're functioning, how we're showing up on a day-to-day -day basis with all the responsibilities that we have. So we wanna make sure that you are tuning in to us every Wednesday and Friday because we're gonna be sharing with you some really important information about mental health awareness. In the meantime, I'd like to share three ideas that I have. So we know that mental health has to do with our psychological, emotional, and social functioning. But the reality is the word mental health sometimes gets a bad rap, and it's just not true. Mental health is universal. It applies to all of us, and it's just that important. We wanna make sure that we give our individual mental health the time and attention that it needs. In the event that we felt like we needed to have some support around our mental health, we wanna take action. We wanna find someone, a counselor, or a family friend or a social worker who could give us some information and support to look at the issues that are troubling to us and make some changes so that our functioning can be more successful and make us feel better overall. It's not necessary that you go it alone. If you ask for assistance, you're gonna be able to get what you need. Similarly, if you had to go see a dentist or get your hair done at the hairdresser, you'd find somebody who worked well with you and who you felt was a good fit and you would continue to see them. If you found for some reason it wasn't a good fit, you wouldn't stop going to the dentist and you wouldn't stop getting your hair done. You would continue to ask until you got what you needed. And that's what we want to do around mental health. We want to ask for what we need. So there you have it. We look forward to seeing you back Friday. Thanks for listening.